this here area. Yeah, I know. That scene that we've seen all a billion times. Okay. And jump. And they all die. We might as well pick up their starbit so that I can maybe show the 3000 starbit transformation if there is one. <coughs> yeah, secret loom, I saw you. Moving on. Because we don't have anything better to do. And you die. I hate you. Yeah, the last one is like really obvious. It's more obvious than the first few. It's like obscene. It's obscene how like obvious it is. You probably saw it like right there. There is no way you could miss it unless you're like blind and happen to be playing this game. And I screwed up pretty bad there, but. Oh well, I didn't. Uh, yeah, I know, I've heard this already. Getting aggravated because I have. Because I want to get the sun before I go on vacation and then I have to upload part one of Okami, which I haven't even recorded yet. Uh, yeah, this is. Like, what? It, it, this is probably one of the easiest screen stars. It's e even easier than the first screen star because it's right there. There's no way you could that. There's no way you could miss it. Like the first one, you could probably miss, but set, but this one, oh my god, there's no way you could miss it. And we get more star bits. What is little cashin? Uh, why do I always say cashin? Seriously. Anyways, so we're about 200 off, a little over, yeah. Anyways, now we're on to this green stars in the right side down galaxy. Yeah, so these ones are actually pretty easy too, except for one of them. One of them is tricky. The second one that is. I forget how to get the first one, but I think that they show it in the preview anyways, so... Like, there's no... There's... That's another one that there's no way you could miss it. Unless you wanted to skip the first preview. I don't want to do that! What are you doing, game? Ugh. Yeah, you can press the switch and get a bunch of coins. I showed this in, like, part 4 or something. Ugh, I don't... Well, let's just go. Yay, we slipped. Ow. I'm being reckless here, man. Good thing this isn't a daredevil run. Uh, let's go. And up here. Yay. Yeah, you don't even need, like, that platform. And we get a bunch of star bits. I'm not even paying attention anymore. Uh, and 200 points. Not really. If they had points in this game, I would probably not have very many. Anyways, moving on. Yeah, we don't get the first green star till probably. Geez, three quarters of the way through the through the level. Or stage, or whatever you want to call it. Potato, potato, tomato, tomato. You know, crazy stuff. Okay. I don't really need that one up. I've got a bunch of lives already. And I'm gonna get even more from the coins that I grab. I hope I don't die here like an idiot. Just watch, I will. Okay, Thwomps, you can stop being scary. Get a running jump. Yay, we didn't die in one hit. Because that would suck. And for some reason, there is... Like, for some... This is one part of the level that I kind of don't get. Like... The part that I don't get... 
is what after it. Uh, okay. As you can see, there's a checkpoint right here. And there's also the next green star, too. Um, but what I don't get is why on earth they have a checkpoint here. This point isn't hard. The fire part isn't hard. I guess they've made it less tedious. But all you have to do to get that green star, it's kind of a pain in the ass. You have to basically long jump towards it. Kind of, it's kind of hard to explain. You long jump towards it, spin jump, as soon as you flip over and you grab it. That's all I need to say. It's very easy. Like, you'll have no trouble at all with it. So, anyways, moving on. The next green star, however, is not easy to get. It is a very royal pain in the... Uh, I don't know. Okay. Yeah, this. Guess what you have to do? You have to triple jump off the swamps. Well, actually you don't, but... Guess what you have to do? You have... Yeah, ha I think you have to do this as Luigi. I think... I actually did get it as Mario, but it's way easier with Luigi. Yeah. Luigi's like king of green stars. If you're having trouble with green stars, go Luigi. That's all I have to tell you. Okay. Bunch of coins. And new clear time. Anyways. Now moving on to even easier green stars, like... The ones in this galaxy, there's only one that's kind of difficult, but the other one is really easy. <coughs> I don't know why I selected the last green star. I guess it's because it's, it's the one I'm driving, I guess. Anyways... I've heard this music quite a bit. The first green star, it gave me trouble because it was Mario, and I think that you have to be Luigi for this. Like, I'm not kidding this time. This, th this time I'm serious about having to be Luigi. Because Luigi jumps ridiculously high, and I barely made that, so... That's basically how you get that green star. You basically cross, cross these ledges. It's right there, so... I don't think you'll have any trouble getting to it if you're using Luigi. And you can actually just basically skip a bunch of the level. By, uh... Okay, there's a green star around here. I forget exactly where it is. I hear it. Yeah, this is the one that I was having a major pain in the ass. You have to angle yourself just right. I think that with Mario, I, I did it a different way. Because there is an easier way to get it than, you know, having to do trial and error and dying super fast. See, right here. And for some reason, I can't see. Anyways, let's move on. Okay, yeah, you can see it right there. Yeah, that's how you grab it. <laughs> it's a real big move by Nintendo, in my opinion, to do that, but... Well, you could probably long jump from the launch star at the end, but... Jumping in the lava is easier. And that is all of the World 1 Green Stars. So, uh, yeah, next time on Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2. Man, I can't believe I got that in three videos. Anyways, next time on Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2, we'll start on the World 2 Green Stars. So, until then, yeah, bye.